Hey everybody, I'm Gabby Fallou with Elevate Bartending and I'm bringing you the Fiesta edition of our Quarantine Cocktail Series. Fiesta is a time-honored tradition in San Antonio. Every year in April, we celebrate with parties, galas, theater shows, culinary events, all to celebrate and honor the women and men who fought in the Alamo and the Battle of San Jacinto. So, we can't go to Fiesta right now, but we can bring Fiesta home. And what better way to celebrate Fiesta than with a handmade margarita? Now, when we show up for events, we bring all of the professional bar tools you'll need for a successful event. And for margaritas, you're gonna need a rimmer, a shaker, a strainer, but don't worry, if you don't have those items at home, we're gonna use home stuff. Let's go. First things first, I've thoroughly washed my hands and we're ready to get started with our mixology. My secret weapon is the mason jar. It's gonna make for a great shaker. So let's talk about ingredients. I've got an ounce and a half of Blanco tequila. You can use any tequila, whatever your favorite is. I've got a half ounce of uh, orange liqueur. You can use triple sec. Uh, orange liqueur is a little bit more of a premium ingredient to make it taste delicious. I've got uh, fresh squeezed lime juice. Now, for the sweet, you can use simple syrup, which is super easy to make, just one to one ratio of sugar and water. But I'm gonna use some agave syrup to make it extra yummy. We've also got some fresh cold filtered water. And before we get started mixing, we need to salt our margarita glass. All right, to do that, we're going to use some kosher salt, but you can use any salt you have. And I'm just gonna put it on a plate. And then I'm just gonna use a lime wedge to rim the glass. I like to do just half salt, but if you like the whole rim salted, please go for it. Okay, there go in there. There you go. And then I'm just gonna add some ice. Perfect. Okay, let's start mixing. All right, to our mason jar with a little crushed ice. We're gonna go ahead and add our tequila, our orange liqueur, about two ounces of fresh squeezed lime juice. And like I said, I'm gonna use agave syrup. Perfect. And then I'm going to add a little bit of cold filtered water. There we go. And then we can see. Make sure this lid is secure. You don't want to get lime juice in your dog's eye. And shake it up for about 30 seconds. All right, I think that's perfect. Let's open that up. It should be all frothy and very cold and smell delicious. Go ahead and pour that over in our glass. And top it off with a little lime wedge garnish. Let's give it a try. That is perfect. Margaritas are so good. For a mocktail version of the margarita, or a limeade, we're gonna go ahead and take a glass of ice. We're gonna use about two uh, ounces of lime juice. Fresh squeeze is preferred. We're gonna use about uh, two or three ounces of simple syrup. There we go. And instead of filtered water, which you can definitely use, I'm actually gonna use some club soda to give it a little bit more sparkle and make it taste very fresh, refreshing. There we go. Give that a stir. And of course, a beautiful lime garnish. We'll see how that tastes. That's so yummy. Remember to like, subscribe, and share, and we'll see you next time. Viva Fiesta.